I've just, yet I've, to find a good time for rape day, but uh, it's not right now. I know that for sure. Yeah. That. So, yeah, I'm brutal. just, I'm like legit. I'm, I read this and I'm just busted up. This is insane. The fact that, like, that's just so, wow, so fucked up. And knowing that it wasn't like a family member, it wasn't like, you know, one of those things where the uncle inappropriate did something. Like, literally some dude was wait, waiting for somebody to leave the house well, and then clearly, just fucking yeah. busted in. Yeah, yeah he and didn't fuck just, this girl up. Like, he didn't just, like, yeah, come like, up he with beat that the on the shit, shit out of her face, too. What should I do? Should I get yeah. a talk? Like, he beat the shit I... out of her face, too. Yeah, that's fucked. Yeah. I don't know how, how that, I don't know how so, guys do that. You're just walking down the street and you're like, should I get a taquito or should I go rape a bitch? Like I don't know how that works in your mind. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, and, I don't I don't I don't get that separation that lack he's, of separation, I he's guess. He's in a country when he get where when he gets caught, uh he will actually pay for his crime. Not like here. So no, let's just no, hope he true. gets caught. So my heart goes out. My heart goes out to uh, Anna Paola, which is her name. Um, I'm really sorry to the family. That sucks. That sucks. That's brutal. I have That's nothing up. funny to. I play. hope they catch this guy, and I hope they do absolutely horrible things to this guy, whoever did it. I wish. So I there's had a sad thing to, to back news. that, but I don't. Yeah. Now I'm going to counter that with something that is not sad. I just found this to be very humorous because it's because it just shows. Well. That's just funny. Um, in uh, where the fuck was this? I guess it doesn't doesn't uh, somewhere in the states. Um, oh yeah, there. The political director uh, somewhere in the states. I don't know. Uh, the political director at People for the American Way. Um, they were doing a live stream uh, company meeting between uh, three people, herself and two others, a guy and a girl. And um, they were doing their stream, and just after that, the meeting started, the political director – I'm not going to pronounce her name because I cannot pronounce it. That's it. Lizette Ocampo. We're going to go with I, that. I've um, already forgotten. So it she, matter. Yeah, no, it doesn't matter. Um, she, clicked, she clicked a button, a button on her computer by accident, and she turned her face into a potato. Um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's – Literally, it's a potato underground, and it's got her got her eye. <laughs> wow! And she couldn't figure out how to fix it, so she had to do the whole meeting as as she looked like a potato. And I just think that's genius. So one of the people on the thing took a screenshot, posted it on Twitter, when it's gone viral. More than five five hundred thousand people have liked it, and as uh, actually, it's even more than that because you look at that. 946,000 people, and this was like a few days ago when it happened. Um, uh, so yeah, uh, I just think that's really fucking torn. Just it's just a humorous thing. Um, so imagine having your big company meeting with a potato. I just think it's funny. I I appreciate that. I wish I could do that. I'll figure out how to do it, and I can do it for us. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, there's shit you can do on filters on your phone. I didn't know you can do on your laptops too. So there you go. Oh yeah, I can do so, just yeah, about so anything potato, with a laptop potato. now. We, Gordon and I have been through all of it. <laughs> you need something done with a laptop? We've done it. <laughs> we, well, we figured it in, out in far <laughs> weirder circumstances than you could ever imagine. Um, <laughs> you know, weird bus stations. <laughs> Uh, on but trains, one time laying on the floor at an A and W. That was a bit of a personal favorite. <laughs> oh yeah, of mine too, especially because they were closed. Are you gonna leave one more hour? <laughs> Just one more hour, I swear to God. <laughs> uh... <laughs> so, oh man. Um... That's... Sorry, uh, I liked your potato so story. I was that. just a little distracted because I'm mean, I'm jumping ahead a little bit here, but I like it. I'm not I'm not contributing to this show at all. I'm already working on the next show, people. Sorry, tune in for that one. It's going to be great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so one company that is one part of this industry that is, that is absolutely booming right now. Would you like to guess what, what industry that is? There is one um, industry right now during this whole corona thing that is just booming, and it doesn't have to do with masks or sanitizers. 
other than porn? Technically. Because porn's got to be just fucking killing it right now. Even uh, then again, not necessarily because you got mad. A lot of people watch porn separately when nobody else, nobody else is around. And not that person's right now, now they always don't. there, especially around their kids. Not right now, they don't. They watch it with their kids. They watch it on their kids. <laughs> they don't care. <laughs> Every, last week, everyone had manners. Uh, this week, nobody gives a fuck. Yeah, nobody cares anymore. <laughs> um, but no, the, the sex toy industry has been just booming. Oh, yeah, of course. Well, uh, that goes hand in hand every, with porn. Uh, that's Literally, what I say, hand in hand. Nah. Right. Literally. <laughs> uh, there's this one company um, where their business has jumped, bumped by uh, 38% initially expected to jump by 50% uh, over by this weekend. So this was, this article was done, be- done before the weekend. Um, said that they would normally hand out around 1,500 sex toys a day from their office. But last week they were handing out close to 5,000. Jesus, <laughs> there is a uh, so yeah, shortage. so there, uh, um, there there is a a, a a condom shortage in the states right now. So, which I don't get. How is that possible? Um, how is I, that even like remotely possible? I mean, condoms cost nothing to produce. Oh Jesus, I've been trying to get Eric and Gordon condoms. They are wildly expensive. But you can get those things for like free down the street. Yeah, I don't. I don't get it. <laughs> I've had them handed to me. <laughs> yeah, they just you can go get handfuls, but you want Eric and Gord stamped on them, and it costs a fucking fortune. <laughs> That's just funny. Um, yeah, I'm really pissed off because this thing was actually supposed to say what it was was that was being their biggest sales, but it actually doesn't tell me that. It's really fucking now, frustrating. Mind you, it might have something um, to do with the fact that the ones I were ordering were open on both ends, so they weren't real popular. I don't know. <laughs> they're more like just a tube uh, <laughs> uh, that's kind of funny it's a sleeve the Eric and Gordon con uh, everyone's a winner everyone <laughs> except for the woman for nine months <laughs> uh, man um, here's something that you'll be partially interested in, be- in because you are a fan of this person, Billy A. Eilish. Hey, Eilish? I am partially... Eilish? How do you pronounce her last name? I am partially interested in just about everything. Okay. Uh, and well, is, how do you pronounce her last name? It is Eilish. Eilish. Okay. It is Eilish, and she's the girl of my dreams, and she's half my age, and that sucks. <laughs> she's more than half your age. <laughs> um, she is pissed right now. Absolutely cool. fucking fucking pissed. I like her more because now. she she was on a tropical vacation. Shocking. Um, and during during her vacation, she you know posted a bunch of regular posters of her, but one of the pictures there's a couple of pictures of her in a bathing suit. Oh no, really? That they got leaked? And she did. They're not leaked. She posted them. They're not oh. sexy pictures. Just like here, look, I'm sitting in a, I'm sitting in something, and just took a picture. Of yeah, but or, she or there's a picture of her in the background wearing a bathing suit. She she wears those big baggy yeah. clothes on purpose, right? It looks like a thing, so she doesn't show off her body or whatever. So, uh, that's a big deal right, for her right. to do that. And she said, her coach, she goes like, I saw comments like, how dare she talk about not wanting to be sexualized and then wear this, um. It was trending. There are comments like, I don't like her anymore because as soon as she turns 18, she's she's like, I don't know what the word is. Awesomer? W dash dash dash. She's like a, I, I don't think know. What oh, they oh mean she's like a awesomer. whore. Like, dude, I can't win. Yeah. I'm pretty uh, so sure she's that's what just they're like trying to pissed, say. Pissed about this. Well, of course she is. That's ridiculous. Um, like, her whole thing is to be against body yeah. shaming, and but they're essentially body shaming her for being hot. That's stupid. Yeah, like her whole thing has been don't body shame people. That's her thing. Um, that's retarded. And I I got to side with her on this one, not just because I think she's awesome, but that's bullshit. Like uh, clearly, her fans aren't getting her message if that's what they turn around and do. Yeah, so, uh, uh, just man. I this again. Just, just 
She sends a great right. message out to young girls. She always has. I think so. I don't know. Maybe she's a fraud. I don't know. But uh, she seems pretty awesome. And that's a really good message to send to kids. And for someone to turn it all on its ass like that, I can tell them to just fuck off. <laughs> that's all. I got nothing. Yeah. Fuck off. People do yeah, that. See, agreed. the problem is she got too big too fast, and that's what happens. As soon as you get as big as she has gotten, as fast as she's gotten, people start fucking cutting you down. And blah, 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 fuck off. Why do we yeah, do that? Exactly. Why do we always cut down? Like the, We're the ones who put them in that position, and then we turn around and fucking hack them off at the knees. Why do we do that? It's, it's a Because sick, people are bored and pathetic losers. It's, uh, I don't like yeah. it. Yeah, no, no, I I agree. Um, so yeah, it's fucked up. It's not right, and people are fucking pathetic, and yeah, they all fan. suck. So fuck I them. I am all. not a fan of any any seventeen year old bitches that make fun of Billie Eilish could go to hell. That's all I got to say. <laughs> um, oh, I dare Greta. I how dare. dare you? Oh, how dare you? Um, um. Uh, 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 yeah. So, uh, the next one, uh, um, a record sort of record. I mean, this isn't, we'll, you'll never see this in the Guinness book of world records, but only because I'll never have you ever heard it. of the cannonball run. Of course I have. <laughs> have you ever, not the movie, but the actual cannonball run? No, I didn't think it was a real thing. It's a real thing. It's been, it's been going on for a very, very long time. Uh, cannonball run. The movie was based off of. The same yeah, that was going on so. secretly between rich people. That yeah. would be what hell uh, of a coincidence uh, uh, if it wasn't. Yeah, no doubt, right? <laughs> um, well, this um, this past, past uh, weekend or last week, um, a uh, does this just saying this guy's a fucking teenager or some shit? Some some dude has officially broken the record set in 2013. Um, in an Audi R uh, A8, um, it, it's it's a run from New York to L.A., and the previous record was 27 hours and 27 minutes or 25 minutes. This guy oh, did it in yeah. 26 hours and 38 38 minutes. That is fucked um, up. And basically, because there's yeah, well, it's because there's nobody on the highway. <laughs> coast to coast in 27 hours. That no, even still, that's impressive. Like uh, we, that's, I can get. It takes me 24 hours it. to get to Calgary. Yeah. But we got a lot of mountains and shit, but still, that's it. That's crazy it, fast. What's the speed? Do isn't they, that crazy do, fast? Do you have an average speed? Uh, that average they, speed they, must they, they, be they, they, fucking 200 at least. Well, they're, well, they're, just, they're just saying that um, uh, they, no, they didn't actually say anything about his actual average speed. Just, I mean, I'm sure you fast. can actually do it. You can. He went fast. Um you can actually, there's actually a clip that you can actually watch the video live, right? I like a, a, a video of it. Yeah. That he did where he did it, did it, uh, showing the whole run. Um, on said so the, the news comes as police across the country report is seeing an increase in speeding due to empty roads on Tuesday, Tuesday morning, a driver was caught on camera wrecking his $750,000 sports car while speeding on the New York city streets, yeah. then running a red light as he attempted to flee the scene. Uh, so he was fucked and under the influence of drugs, so he screwed. Um, so yeah, so yeah, so this dude did it in his whole run. It's an amazing thing. Um, yeah, 26 hours. That's crazy. Good on you, dude. I, I'm impressed. That's it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't, like I don't know what to say. That would scare um, the piss out of me. I'd never do it, but it's cool. When oh, Gordon I and I go on our movie. road trip, which could actually happen this year now, feasibly, uh, if this whole COVID thing wraps up before the summer does, Gordon and I can go on our road trip. We will not be going that fast, but we will make it to New <laughs> Jersey eventually and uh, to Ashburn, Virginia, and to wherever we can get on whatever amount of money we have at the time. And whoever says they want us there, we will come there. And that'll be part of my awesome oh. con conceptual idea. Eric and Gord, what if we're right in your house? That'll be cool. We'll come to your <laughs> house. It'll be amazing. I'm gonna... We will podcast from your house. Gonna make us dinner. It's going to be fucking dope. Uh, I, 
actually, I have your average speed here. The average speed over the shortest route possible between 